Live from the Broadcast Center in Los Angeles, this is KCAL 9 News at 4. Now at 4.30, a day after that violent rollover crash, we're learning more about the serious injuries Tiger Woods suffered. The horrific crash in Rolling Hills Estates left the pro golfer with leg injuries that required extensive surgery. KCAL 9's Alex Biston spoke to an orthopedic surgeon on the potential road to recovery for Tiger Woods. After an injury like this, things are just never the same. Tiger Woods is at the beginning of a long road to recovery after the golfing legend suffered major leg injuries during a rollover crash Tuesday morning. Dr. Jaime Hernandez says Woods is just lucky to have survived the impact. All of this taken together obviously is a pretty severe injury and requires healings of different structures, bone, soft tissue, muscle, tendon possibly nerves. A statement posted on the golfer's Twitter account says Woods is responsive and recovering after undergoing extensive surgery on his lower right leg and ankle. It's an injury that Dr. Hernandez says could have resulted in a lost limb. There can be so much swelling that builds up from all of the trauma that that swelling can actually prevent the blood from flowing into the leg. And if that happens, when a leg has no blood supply, it can die. Prior to the accident, Woods was recovering from his fifth back surgery. Now, Dr. Hernandez says his leg injuries will require six months to a year of recovery. After treating similar injuries, he believes the golfer will be able to walk again. But as far as getting back to playing the sport, he mastered. We have leg limitations, back limitations, but, you know, again, the mental side is, is, is a huge factor. There's no way he will not be experiencing post-traumatic stress disorder. Dr. Judy Rosenberg is the director of the Psychological Healing Center in Sherman Oaks. She says the initial feeling after a traumatic experience like a car accident is shock. They may feel numb, disoriented, they may feel that they're not even living in this world. As Woods battles a physical and mental recovery, many are left wondering what this means for the golfer's future. He's going to have to go through massive therapy, uh, physical therapy, and so on. And so who he has been being, which is an athlete, may not be accessible to him for quite some time. Tiger Woods has overcome injuries in the past, and Dr. Hernandez says if he can use his mental strength to overcome physical challenges, he believes that Woods will be able to get back into the game. Alex Biston, KCAL 9 News.